don't like this, Nev. What's not to like? I don't like you going in on your own. This is not the time to change the way we start doing things. What are you going to do? I'm off duty. I just want to follow up, that's all. We haven't got a warrant to case the studio. We haven't got a warrant to speak to him. I'm missing something. Let me know what you find. And leave it how you found it. Sylvia, you really need to try not to be so sour-faced at these things. Look at them all. Lapping up all that convoluted bullshit he read straight out of first-year art school. Oh, good God, I need another drink. You know these people are the only ones who comes to this sort of thing. Even so, they could be at least a little selective. These days they seem to let in any and all of the hoi polloi. He wouldn't have let them in. He wouldn't have let anyone in. Not without sharing his divine intuition. <sighs> That'd be such a bad thing. <sighs> they don't get it. None of them understand. They need him here. We need him here. I don't need anything. Try to get it right this time. I have to be able to feel the picture. Hello, and welcome to the Hugo Bode exhibition. Would you like to take a tour of the work? Would you like to join us tonight, sir? Uh, no, thanks. You might find it educational. Yeah, I'm sure I will. Hugo's Peruvian collection. The style is both a contemporary interpretation of and an homage to traditional Mayan craft. Oh, yeah, of course. You have no idea what you're looking at, do you? I'll be honest. Just a piece of scrap metal, really, isn't it? <laughs> well, you're not alone. Most of the people in here are so busy trying to look like they understand, they're actually aging in front of me. At least you're honest. Seems like a waste of time. You're Sylvia Larkin, the curator, right? Yes, I am. And you are? Yeah, David Neville. Pleasure. So, Miss Larkin, what can you tell me, Mr. Bolt? I know most things, Mr. Neville. We were at art school together. We both studied under Don Moore. I see. He was brilliant then as well. It was just astonishing how he could create such pieces and. No time at all. I think it was his relationship with Donwell that made him what he is. From the very beginning, they recognised each other's talent. So Donwell invited Hugo to move in with him and study under him directly. Hold on, Taylor. Uh, would you mind taking that outside? You're disturbing the rest of the exhibition and I'll ask you to leave. I was just leaving. Do you mind stepping out of the way? How's it going there? Um, it's arty farty. What have you got for me? The place is spotless. There's nothing the place has done all day. Anything recent? I've got a receipt here for blender materials and some chemicals. It's dated for over a week ago. Okay, keep looking. Let me know what you find. Is 
Mr. Bold, good evening. Inspector, what a surprise. You hope to find Domo here, please, by all means, look around. But unless he's hiding under the bar. I'm not here on duty. Thought I'd come and enjoy the exhibition. I was passing. The world will not accept you like this. The canvas has to broil with the essence of your talent, not the peripheral shit you've decided to on it. Let's try and fill this one with something worthwhile, shall we? Lots of work here. Never knew you were so prolific. Is that the word? Yes, it is. I don't work. I don't eat, Inspector. Oh, yeah. A man does have to eat, of course. Do you think it's been affected by his disappearance? Your work, I mean. I thought you were off duty. Oh, I was, uh, just wondering. Inspector, Domo's absence has neither dulled nor sharpened my skills. He was both a brilliant and difficult man to learn from. But the art is all me. It was my hand that held the brush. We are both professionals, and our work is to see beyond the surface of things. Take a look around, Inspector, please. Have a drink. You may find something that speaks to you. Remember, God is in the detail. Stilted, am I? What is this? Well, they asked me to comment on your progress. I merely shared with them the facts. I am not fucking stilted. No, you are arrogant and childish, which stilts your art. Where are you going? I'm done. Fuck this. Grow up, Hugo. You're not even half ready. You're just a callous, rough, virginal version of what you could be. I spent 20 years- I'm sick of this! Fuck you, Dunmore! You're nothing. You're a carcass. A disgrace to the very title you give yourself. Get the fuck out! Grow up, you guys again. Right. The world will not accept you. Not the peripheral shit you decide to put on it! Why, shall we? Go on, Taylor. I've got something here, Nev. 